Thank you very much. My pleasure, Mr. Commissioner. Uh, thank you again. Uh, she's, uh, she's gone to sleep. I'll put this little knife in the freezer, shall I? Swallowed poison. They smelled cyanide, sir. Who would have given him that? Whoever killed him. Who would have access to it? Is such a drug? Yes, sir. Oh, pharmacist, doctor. Wasn't that Patrick O'Connor, a doctor, Captain? So you said that, Carl, yes. O'Connor is a doctor. I wonder if I should call Scorpio. After all, he is still the commissioner until somebody else is appointed. Well, the Oriental chauffeur turned up at Robin's camp with his letter of authorization to take Robin with him back to New York City to her grandmother. Forged. Oh, perfectly. She was taken from your apartment. Yes. Well, why was Philomena there in the first place? Robin says that she lives in a big building. Well, um, the maid was on vacation, and what was Robin away at camp, Philomena said that she'd look after things. She never saw her attackers. No. They attacked her from behind. Oh, and, uh, they left this. Warning you against going to the police. Yes. Or telling anyone that she'd been kidnapped. I didn't tell the police at all. Which is why Bert and I had no luck with the New York police. You know, it's strange. They kidnapped Robin, and yet they brought her here to you unharmed. I mean, thank goodness, but why? I don't like asking this question, but... Go ahead, anything. It'll help. Could the DVX know that I'm Robin's father? Well, someone knows. I don't know whether it's the DVX, though. Now this doll. Now, 
somebody broke in here and tried to steal it. It's the second attempt, I might add. The first one was on the waterfront. I don't understand. And neither do I. But uh, they would have gotten it if Frisco hadn't moved fast. Why would, why would somebody want that doll? It's just a doll. I mean, she adores it. She's had it for months. Well, I opened it. It's empty, of course. Oh, Robert. Somebody knows us too well. Any ideas? None. Ever since she was born, I kept her identity a secret. You almost succeeded. Well, at least as far as I was concerned. Do you feel like we're being maneuvered? Yeah. And I don't like it. And I don't like it. Because Robin is in danger. I can feel it. She could be. Oh, Robert, it's... I'm so tired. I, I'm not thinking straight. And I can't figure out the connections here. Or the moves, or anything. Our child. Yes. I'm not used to this sort of thing. I mean, I think she's gorgeous, charming, beautiful, intelligent, but, but is that just because I'm her father? Well, you thought she was that before you knew she was your daughter, didn't you? Yeah. Yeah, you're right, I did. But she's all of those things. And she's my daughter. Now, that just proves... I, I'm not the least bit biased. No, no, right. of course not. Well, uh, Philomena, she helps a lot, too. Uh-huh. Yeah, well, you see, uh, I happen to know all about the blonde-haired lady named Love. Must have been very hard for you not to tell her that you were her mother. I couldn't, Robert, not with our past. What are we going to do? I know something that I'm not going to do. I'm not going to leave here until I find out who's threatening my child. We'll send for Philomena and bring her here. Oh, no! 